Hi, I am Federico Capuano, CTO of OpenWISP. I have over 10 years experience in mentoring with the Google Summer of Code, and I'm here to talk to you about OpenWISP. Uh, OpenWISP was born from the need of an open source solution for managing public Wi-Fi hotspot networks. Uh, we aim to become the equivalent of what WordPress is for websites, but for network automation uh, and management. That is a solution which is open source, web-based and extensible. Our solution is used by municipalities, cities, but also universities, startups and even established tech companies. Uh, initially, it was built for public Wi-Fi and hotspots, but over time we added a lot more features because users started to requesting to manage different networking use cases. So nowadays, uh, OpenWiz is widely used for automatic provisioning of VPN tunnels like OpenVPN and WireGuard and mesh networks, 4G deployments in which there's a router which has a 4G uplink and any use case supported by OpenWrt, which is a Linux distribution used for routers. So whatever OpenWrt can do, OpenWiz can support it and hence deploy it, which means you can have thousands of routers doing having the same configuration and OpenWrt can manage those configurations and allow you to monitor and update configuration, update firmware and so on. So uh, we've been involved in Google Summer of Code for five years, since 2017. I personally, personally have been involved for more than that. Uh, we have 17 projects completed successfully. Uh, I provide here a link where you can look at the projects there's a blog post for each project. So if you're interested in that, please take a look. There's a lot of details there. And there's also the names of the contributors who participated. You can even get in touch with them, ask questions. And we use a lot of networking technologies, programming languages, and a lot of Linux. We use Python, we use, of course, HTML, CSS, JavaScript, because it's a web-based solution, SQL, Lua, shell scripts, lots of Linux, as I said, OpenWrt, Ansible, Docker, even Node.js, Django framework, a lot, React, and a lot more tools. So there's really a lot of technologies to learn while working with us. And there's a lot of space to grow because uh, we are a small organization and we strive to focus on what we really need when doing Google Summer of Code projects. and we really want to put effort into making sure that what we do during the program is used in the real world. So your work is gonna have real impact on the community and you're gonna have a lot of room to grow your skills. The best GSOC contributors who have shown motivation and, and skills uh, have been able to continue working with us and being sustained financially by working on projects that, are, uh, that have funding even after GSOC. So that is really great if you would love to work on open source in a sustainable way, and we're gonna help you to do that. So thank you very much for your attention and I hope to see you soon.